Hey, Wayne here again. Just wanted to show you a neat little way to tie a horse up. It's called a Hollywood knot. You see in the uh, movies, you see the cowboys, they ride up to a saloon, they tie the horse up real quick, and they come out, and they just give the rein a quick tug and climb on their horse and ride out of town real quick. like. And so it's a real easy knot to tie and very secure and easy to untie, too, after you tied it. So it starts off. Very important that you don't leave too much slack between the halter on your horse and where you tie him up. You want about two and a half to three feet at the very most. Anything more, he's liable to step on it and get hung up on it. If you were to leave a lot of slack in the rope and a, hanging down on the ground, he might put his foot over it and it could turn into a real disaster for a, your horse and cause him to be so scared of being tied up that he'd pull back at the drop of a hat. He might tear the fence apart. He might cause rope burns on himself or cripple himself up for good. So these are very important things you gotta keep in mind when you tie a horse up. A lot of responsibility goes with that. So when you tie your horse up, make sure you tie him to something good and secure. I'm tying him to this corral fence right now just to show you, but I would never tie my horse here because it's not secure enough. You see it moves and he could pull on that and probably pull this corral around if he really got scared. And so I don't want him to do that. And as long as he knows there's an end to the rope, which I taught him, then he's only going to pull back so far. And when he realizes that it's not moving, he's going to come back and come forward. So again, we're going to have about two and a half, three feet like this. So I'm going to bring these two together. I'm going to put it underneath and up over top. And then I'm going to go one wrap on that loop. And a second lap a wrap so I got two now I'm gonna come back and around and I'm gonna be three and I'm gonna include the lead rope now and I'm gonna bring it up and I'm gonna make another loop like so and I'm gonna include his lead rope and I'm gonna push that second loop through the first loop I'm gonna pull that tight and I'm gonna take the end of the halter the lead rope and I'm going to slip it through that and lock it so it won't come undone now I can leave him like this and go to town come back and he'll still be tied up here and when I want to untie it all I do is take this and pull that through that loop and I'm going to give this a tug like so and it comes undone really simple and easy not to to learn how to tie and you'll find it'll make a world of difference.